Hello everyone, welcome to this step by step guide on how to set up a pipeline to copy data from Azure Blob Storage to another storage. First, we need to create a Azure Blob Storage. For that, search Blob and open Storage Account. Click on Create Storage Account. Then select Subscription and Resource Group. Then give an unique name. and then click on review and create and finally click on create meanwhile in a new tab launch the azure data factory if you don't create azure data factory please follow the previous video to create how to create data factory once the storage account is created Click on go to resource, then click on storage browser, then click on blob container. Then click on add container and create input and output folder and upload one CSV file in input folder. After that, go to the data factory. Then in the data factory UI, click on manage in the left hand pane, then select link services. After that, click on create link service. Choose Azure Blob storage as a data store. After that, provide a name of your linked service, for example, linked services. Select your Azure subscription and storage account name blob storage after that click on test connection to check the connection finally click on create to create link services again in the data factory ui click on author in the left hand pane click on triple dot in data set then click on new data set from here choose azure blob storage and click continue over here select data type as csv then click on continue provide the name like input csv data then select the linked services we have created after that file path will appear and here click on the folder icon and select input folder then select the csv file you have uploaded and finally click ok Now again click on triple dot in the data set then click on new data set from here choose azure blob storage and click continue from here choose json and click continue now provide a name like output data then select the linked services we have created again the file path will appear and here click on the folder icon and select output folder and finally click ok now that our linked service are set up let's create the pipeline to copy data click on triple dot in pipeline then click on new pipeline in the activities pane search for copy data and drag the copy data activity into the pipeline canvas click on copy data activity to configure it in the source tab click on source data set and select input data now configure the sync dataset by clicking on the sync tab and click on sync dataset and select output data. Now we are almost done. Click on debug to test the pipeline. Once validation is successful, click on publish on and then click on publish. Once the publish is done, go to the output folder and see that .json file copied or not. And you can see the file is successfully copied. 
Congratulations, you have successfully set up a data factory pipeline in Azure Data Factory. Thank you for watching. If you found this tutorial helpful, please like, share and subscribe for more tutorials on Azure Data Factory.